Alrighty guys, so I'm attempting to try out a new kind of thing for the channel here. Um, in my last video you saw I did the AMD FX8320E 8-core upgrade for the desktop. You can see it over here. Um, and we're going to be doing some performance testing. Now, Fraps is being Fraps, and with it on the desktop recording, if I switch to a full screen application, Fraps just pretty much goes screw you and doesn't record it. So, uh, I'll have to figure that out. But, um, yeah, so far, what I can say about this 8 core is I am incredibly impressed. I paid 137 bucks for it, and um, we're sitting on the Arctic Freezer 11 CPU cooler, and as you can see, temps are very, very acceptable. Um, under full load, it normally doesn't get above, like, 50, so that is awesome. Um, also, where am I going with this? I have no idea. But, um, also, we are running the... Radeon HD 7770 and uh, it's the 2 gig version, the 2 gig gigahertz edition. It is overclocked as hard as I possibly can overclock it. Uh, right now it's in the idle state but we're at 1250 on the core and 1375 on the memory. So uh, just to show you that. Um, so let's go ahead and jump into one of the more demanding games that I have and I'll be with you in a minute. Okay, so we are in The Witcher 2 right now. Everything on maximum settings, all except for uber sampling, but everything else is completely maxed out as far as it will let me do it. Um, and you will see how this runs. There might be a bit of stutter because my hard drive is going to go, ah, oh, what are you trying to do to me when it's trying to write all these textures? So, um, let's see how this goes. We are at 30 frames per second right now. So far, it is running. Company! Hold it! Take the knights alive. I just said if you don't order, you'll rip your gun. You sightseeing? No mercy. The assault has begun. The gods be with you. The king awaits you. We'll skin them alive! A beautiful day for battle. Fear not, Excellency. We're out of range of their arbalists. I. Finally! So so as you can see, Traitors of the realm boil tar on the walls while you dally with the royal advisor. How may I assist you, sire? We mount an assault today, and you'll be at my side. Follow me, gentlemen. Let's not keep the traitors waiting. Sire, you said we were out of range. That was a ballista, Excellency. Its arms strengthened with bronze plates and strung with horsehair. It can propel heavy bolts up to a mile away. A deadly and very costly weapon. An experienced crew can cock and release two bolts each minute. Yet it has one flaw. Your Grace, please take cover. The recoil of the arms is so strong upon firing that the weapon shifts. It simply cannot hit the same spot twice. I had no idea your grace was a learned military engineer. I'm not. I gave the Baroness those ballistae two years ago for her birthday. Sire. What say you, Excellency, of men who live in spite of such wounds? And what say you, your grace, of soldiers who inflict them? Those who did this live no more. Master Geralt, I wish to converse with you once the storm of battle has subsided. Forgive me, Excellency, but I plan to leave the royal court as soon as possible. Who might I know why? Too often they take me for someone I'm not. What do they call you, soldier? Wait. You served with me at Brenneran during our foray into the Pontar Valley. Norman Sazer. Still an arbalist? Yes, sir. Fight has not been kind. <laughs> Norman Sador, for your years of faithful service to the Crown, I appoint you Decurion of the Arbalists. Onwards, gentlemen. No reason to dawdle. And this game still looks really, really nice. Like, really, really nice. The ground textures are a bit... Eh, 
the rest of it. Awesome. As you can see, it runs really Forgive well. my candor, Your Majesty, but uh, I they're my children. What? Your Grace, forgive me. Piss on the Your Majesty is entirely with the Adderit Ice. This conversation is over. Black one. I couldn't have handled it better myself. Ha! Have you nothing new, sire? I will. Where are you aiming, imbecile? Soldier! Spyglass! One and a half degrees. Did we hit the bastard? He's down. Ha! One less traitor. Time to attack. Follow me, Witcher! So, that is this game. Which, uh... Is doing a really nice job of running really well. So, that makes me happy. So, as you can see, this thing does a nice job of handling uh, pretty demanding games. Um, without even sweating, so, awesome, um, hope you enjoyed the video, I'm not really good at these types of things, but, um, maybe if I get better at it or whatever, we'll have more of these sort of things in the future, um, so yeah, uh, just let me know in the comments or whatever what you think, if you have the FX8320, and, um, how far you've overclocked it. On this one, I got it to 4.3 gigahertz on this cooler, but it's approaching the maximum temp of the processor, so I need to get like water cooling or something if I'm really gonna push it. But it really doesn't need it. Um, I see no degradation in performance or no gains in performance um, just by overclocking it. The only thing it helps out with is uh, rendering in Sony Vegas, and that's about it. So, yeah. All right. I will talk to you guys later.